Pastor Esowa said Christians must understand God's words and parables to gain the blessings that comes with it. Even the prophecy of God's word will be waiting for what you are saying. Pastor said, don't go and sit down. You must be, you must rise up. Because prophecy will be fulfilled when the other party plays role. A whole God has been saying, when I die, I will rise up. When I die, I will rise up. He kept on saying that separately. When the challenge came, what he said before happened. He said Nigerians' current challenges can be subdued once there is a divine understanding and focus on the essence of the season. What I would advise Nigerians to do is to seek after the person who is the one for the purpose of the reason why we are celebrating the Easter. Seek after him, look for him, love him, do his will. He is love personified. If you must enjoy Easter and, and draw out from it, you must also extend love to everyone. Extend love to your neighbors, your loved ones, and all of that. Other members of the congregation had various views on the essence of the death and resurrection of Jesus Christ at the Easter season. He died and rose to give us eternal life. So you can believe in Jesus Christ as Lord and Savior. You don't only live in this world. Beyond this world, you live in glory and in eternity. I see it as a, a time of reflection. A time of um, one reflecting into his life or her life to be able to have a change for a, a, a future. Easter mainly is the, it's all about the death and resurrection of Jesus Christ. And without the death and resurrection of Jesus Christ, Christianity will be incomplete. And the message of Easter uh, is basically that of love. God loved the world so much that he gave his only begotten son. As Christians celebrate the Easter season, it is hoped that the country will experience a change of fortunes. Anthony Momodu, Liberty News.